Here's your WNEM TV 5 news update. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jamie Sherrod. Here's a look at the top stories we're following tonight. The state reporting 1,522 new cases and 15 additional deaths. 14 of those deaths were identified during a vital records review. This brings the state's overall total to more than 134,000 cases and the death toll near 7,000. Well, snow days may no longer be needed for school districts across the state, as many students are learning online during the pandemic. The Michigan Department of Education says the state's guidance on snow days remains the same for students attending classes in person, but adds that students learning remotely won't be as lucky because the department does not expect requests for snow days for online classes. A new COVID-19 model predicts U.S. coronavirus deaths could approach 400,000 by February. The model predicts daily deaths could peak at more than 2,000 in mid-January. The new projections are based on current conditions. If the U.S. eases social distancing mandates, the number could grow to more than 500,000. Experts say if 95% of people in the U.S. wore masks, more than 79,000 lives could be saved. A local organization giving away free food, clothing, and more. God's Helping Hands of Hemlock and Merrill, passing out necessities to everyone who stops by Zion Lutheran Church. All you have to do is register. Today they serve more than 50 families. Their giveaways happen year-round on the second and fourth Saturday of every month. Next week they're also holding a special giveaway. Now here's John with a look at your weekend forecast. Thank you, Jamie. Let's go over your WNEM TV5 weather update for the rest of tonight. We will continue to stay mainly dry, clear to partly cloudy. Cooler temperatures, though, will be down back into the 40s for most of us, some upper 30s the further north you go into the day on Sunday. The cooler temperatures continue, but it looks like we stay mainly dry, partly to mostly sunny temperatures reaching back into the lower 60s by your Sunday afternoon. Here's a look at the seven day forecast. Better rain chances come into the day on Monday at 70. That'll be an afternoon and evening chance. A few early showers lingering into Tuesday morning at 65. It looks like we're mainly dry for Wednesday at 61. Then cooler temperatures were in the 50s Thursday into the weekend. At least we're staying dry for next Saturday. In the first Warren 5 Weather Center, I'm meteorologist John Gross. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24-7 for the latest news, weather, and information.